welcome to a new video please don't forget to like comment and subscribe and if you're new here i want to say welcome you can also follow me on my social media on my instagram and tiktok on today's video we're going to be doing this diy side table it's going to cost you less than five dollars so what i did i picked up two of these foam boards i needed something that will circle and bigger where i can just trace and then cut out so the only thing i had at the moment was my lampshade so that's what i did i grabbed the pencil went around and then i just cut it out with a box cutter On the second foam board, I went ahead and I just cut another circle out. For the base, I'm just gonna be using two of these trash cans or bins i'm not sure what they are but i picked them up at the dollar tree and i went ahead and i glued them together with a little bit of hot glue my two foam rounds i just glued together with some regular school glue so to cover the top of the table i'm going to be using some popsicle sticks these are in the medium size i went ahead and just trimmed out the edges on all of those after cutting for about 30 minutes this is what i'm left with so i went in with some wood glue and i started attaching the pieces to the foam board As you can see that by this time I went ahead and I took out my hot glue because it was easier and quicker to dry. And this is how the top came out. For the stand of the table, I went ahead with some black chalk paint and a foam brush. And I went ahead and I covered those two trash cans in a black. I did a couple layers of that until it was completely covered.
For my tabletop, I went in with some stain and I gave the top two coats. And here I am giving the bottom piece a, another coat of the black paint. So I was going to be needing something to cover up the edges on my tabletop. I went in with these popsicle sticks which are a little smaller and I found the ones that were more bendable. I went ahead and clipped the edges on those and then grabbed my hot glue gun and then I just went around the whole top. So I gave the tabletop a second coat of stain and then I sprayed it with some uh, clear matte spray just to seal all that in. And this is how our table came out. As always, I want to say thank you for watching. Thank you.